a good Sunday morning, I should say. My name is Brian Walmer, and I'm here to do, I guess you could say this is going to be, I, I guess you might say this might be a little new for a certain animated movie reviewer here on YouTube and at the website thatfellowinthecoat.com. The guy I'm talking about is Huey Lewis. And his real name is Logan Rinbear. Or, or, well, his real name is Logan, let's just put it that way. Now, first of all, Huey, Logan, I want to tell you right now that I'm, I can understand, I can understand that you're a little busy and all that with certain other reviews. And that you're not totally into the whole, uh, okay, you requested, I'm going to do it right away deal. But I do have a couple of requests that you might want to think about in the near future. Now, you're probably asking yourself, though, Huey, why am I doing this in front of everybody? It's because I want everybody to know that even though you and Jamie Tude and some other people are on this website, right behind me, this website, even though you guys are on that website, right behind me, this website, if you will, and that even though not many people probably know about it, I'm here to help you guys out. And also I'd like to know what it takes to get on that site. But anyway, getting back to what I was saying here, the reason I'm doing this is to just help you out in some way, but to also think, get your opinions on these kind of requests. Now you might find some on uh, the forums, especially in your area. There is one I did just recently today. And that review has something to do with this. Now I'm not now the review now the request I have for that review is not reviewing the entire series because I know you're a fan of it. No, no, no. I'm talking about reviewing the final four episodes: Choir of the Wolf, Druid Hedge, Spy Hog, and Doomsday Project. Object as one movie because in case you haven't heard whoa, in case you haven't heard heard I mean that fellow in the code, code has talked about it Jamie Tude would agree on it Ratchitsu would agree on it anybody on this site this site here would agree on it that the final four episodes known to many Satyam fans as the underground film, the Doomsday Project movie, would love to see a review about it. Now I've done a retrospective and you can see that on my channel if you want to. But what I'm saying is this is a special request. Now again, I understand that you're busy doing other projects. I can understand you're doing right now currently, or you're going to start doing the top ten tear-jerking songs and animated features. Then you're going to do Alpha and Omega. And then Legends of the Guardians and whatever else after that. But again, I understand, and again, I understand that, but I'd love to see you do this in the near future. Love you, I would love to see your opinions on um, potentially what is an underground film, animated film, but it's not recognized as one. Now I can say that um, Sadi, the Sadi M series has come out on individual DVD sets lately uh, thanks to N Circle Entertainment with four episodes each. The newest one is coming out this Tuesday called Doomsday Project. The only problem with that though, Huey, is the fact is the fact that the episode Spy Hog and the, ep the episode Spy Hog is already on Freedom Fighters U on the Freedom Fighters Unite DVD. So the way, so how they're going to work this would be the major question. But again, I'm just letting you know.
this would be something but again all I'm asking is if you think about doing this because I guarantee you do the you do the special review and people will be flocking to your site and to this site just like that I guarantee it but if you don't want to I can understand but there is another movie I'd like to see you review now I don't know if you review anime films or not well actually I think you do do anime films because you've mentioned that but I don't know if you've ever thought about doing this one there is somebody here on YouTube that already did it but I'd like to know what your thoughts are and again, I, and again, getting back to what I was saying, I understand that you're not the kind of guy, you're not the kind of reviewer, that when somebody requests something, they automatically do it. I mean, take a look at me. Somebody's still asking me to do a top ten, they're still asking me to do a quiz, another quiz on Sonic the Hitchhawk. <laughs> and I have people requesting me to do certain vi uh, fan vids with, me, with, video, with certain songs. And I have yet to do some of those things. Because I take my time and I think about it. And I can understand that you're the kind of person that does the same thing. But, again, this is just another request. And this request comes from a very unusual source. You see, there's a movie, Huey, an anime movie that you may have heard of, and you may not have heard of. But once you take a look at it, you'll be thinking to yourself it looks pretty good the animation's pretty good story might be a little you know what's really going on deal and then the climax the ending of it or the final 15 20 minutes of it might make you think WTF if you know what I mean and that movie I'm talking about is right here I don't know if you could read that title it's Revolutionary Girl Utena the movie that's right, Revolutionary Girl Utena the movie. A lot of people have their own uh, opinions about the film. You know, some some really have their own opinion. Why they have their own opinions? Well, they just do. But those that have given their own opinions are, you know, kind of like, well, like I mentioned, like I just mentioned would be kind of like anybody else that reviews it for the first time towards the end they'd be thinking WTF so that's just another request for something you could try to think about in the near future because again like I said I understand you're not the kind of person that sees the request and then does the review automatically because somebody wants it I can understand you have other things to do these are just ideas for the near future now of course there is one more and this is something I'd like to do as a collaboration with you. Something like a, a duet, if you will. And that is Transformers the movie, the 1986 film. That's right. I'd love to do a collaboration with you on that. Because believe me, I saw that when I was about seven years old on VHS. Not in the theaters, but on VHS. And I'd like to do a review on that. Basically also to compare both versions. That's just another request. And there's plenty of other requests out there. Plenty of others. And you know, I want to know what your thoughts are on Yogi Bear. That would be a good... You know, that's another good one you could do for the near future. Put that on your list for possible future things to... reviews to do after you get all your, other, all your other projects out of the way, man. Think of it this way. Reviewing Yogi Bear, the new one coming out in December, as well as reviewing Hey There, It's Yogi Bear, the 1964 classic. Think about it. Heck, even, you know what, you, you know, that, that is a good idea for you, Huey. That is a good idea for a future idea, for a future, something to do in the future. Do a Yogi Bear situation, like a Yogi Bear week or a Yogi Bear month, or something like that. We talk about all the Yogi Bear movies, from Hey There to Great Escape to Spruce Goose to Invasion of the Space Bears to First Christmas and even to now. You could try that. that I bet you'd get a lot of people reviewing or uh, wanting to see it. But those are just ideas for the near future, my friend, because again, I understand you have a lot of other projects going on right now. And I understand that you're not the kind of guy 
it looks at a request and says, okay, I'll go do it right now. You know, basically drops everything and does it. No. You're the kind of guy that says, okay, I'll think about it, let me finish these other things, and if i got time, I'll do it. But these are just ideas, my friend. Now, if you want any more information about, let's say, Revolutionary Guru Uchina, look it up, Google it, you'll see a lot of information. And these are just requests I would like to see you do in the near future. Not right away, but in the near future, after all your projects are done. After everything is done and done with. Because again, I understand you're not the kind of person that does a review right away because somebody wants it. You're not the kind of guy that says, it goes on to your computer like this and says, Oh, here's a request. Well, here's a request for this movie, for a movie, for a review of this movie. Well, I guess I ought to do this. I ought to start this request right now. It drops everything. You know, I know, you, I know you're not the kind of guy that does that. So, I'm just saying, these are just for future ideas and future ideas for future shows if you want to do them. And that's all I want to say. Keep up the good work, my friend. You're doing great. I loved the review on Freddy as FRO7. Definitely a good review. And definitely a great opinion on what is basically considered an underrated, animated, I guess it's hard to say, classic, if you will. But that's apparently what it sounds like it is. So, <laughs> um... Take care, my friend. Keep up the good work. And think about these requests. We'll talk to you later.